years. St. Michael Lutheran School in Fort Myers has been among Southwest Florida's elite basketball programs and this year they took their game to new heights traveling to Indiana and winning their first ever mm -hmm, national championship. Four in your corners Malcolm Johnson has the story. On any given day you can catch kids playing ball at St. Michael Lutheran School. It's a small school only 330 kids but the number of championship players and championship banners are markings of what make it a powerhouse. But what you won't normally catch at St. Michael's is this. Boys basketball coach Robert Schaff getting his head shaved by his players just after returning from the Lutheran Basketball National Championship. So I said if we win, I would shave my head. And not thinking it all really could come true. Let the meeting of the blade and the shaving cream show. It did come true. Students cheered on the coach and the players in a pep rally to celebrate their victory. We you know how to beat teams from five different states, from Wisconsin, Indiana, Illinois, Nevada, and then Texas in the final game. They won that final game by nine points, bringing the school and its coach of over 30 years its first national championship. Hard work pays off. That's what it comes down to, is putting the time in. I have a couple of boys who come in 6.30 every morning just shoot for an hour. And it's that work ethic that allowed them to do what every team in March wants to do, cut down the nets and bring the trophy back home. Malcolm Johnson, Fox 4, in your corner. The girls' team didn't come back empty-handed either. They finished third place in those national championships. Congratulations to everybody at St. Michael's. Uh,